and Kylie's relationship is falling apart. They're always yelling and can't hear each other. Their daughter, Mary, follows their example when playing her dolls. Her parents give her a family example. Mary's dolls also had a fight and smashed the whole house. Dad wanted to fix everything, but they couldn't agree on this, too. They will destroy not only each other, but everything around them. They will have to build their relationship first, and then everything else. The parents' love is the foundation. The new dollhouse shouldn't break. Dad built the top floor and the attic. Mom built the first and second floors. It's a lot bigger than the old one. Mary's dolls now have a new home. It's amazing. They really look like Tom and Kylie. Now they're Ooh. alive. There's clearly still a lot of work to do around the house. The dolls are planning how to set up the house. There must be a TV in the living room, and it should be big enough to watch the Super Bowl. By the way, the dolls have the same names as Mary's parents. It was her idea, not mine. And they're already fighting about the TV. Nothing new. Maybe their relationship needs to become sweeter. This is little Mary trying to make peace between them. When she had a fight with a neighbor boy, the ice cream made them friends. Well, if they don't want it, she will eat it with pleasure. Kylie the doll is in a good mood. She's cleaning up her new home. Tom is trying to catch the vacuum cleaner. It got scared of him for some reason. Everything's under control. Maximum power mode on. Let's get to work. Oh, it's too much. Now it's really super powerful. Everything in the house is going inside the crazy machine. It almost sucked Kylie. The poor thing could barely escape from the vacuum cleaner mouth. Oh, Tom is going to be in trouble now. Not even a minute passed without a fight. It's time to think about the furniture. The magical world of dolls is simpler than our confusing reality. Tom just sucks the most expensive sofas out of the magazine with a vacuum cleaner. And then he shoots the house with the furniture. And most importantly, Kylie liked it. Wow, Tom hit the target after all. Mary decided it was time for the dolls to sleep and restore energy. The bedroom's almost ready, but this couple obviously needs two blankets. Or even separate bedrooms in different houses different cities, continents, or even planets. Tom was left with nothing. Now the comfortable sleep is a problem. Today he won't sleep anyway, but he can spend the time usefully. The saw and the logs. He's like an artist who's caught a muse. So Tom built a bunk bed, but even that didn't solve his problems. Kylie still takes away his blanket. He can't hide from her even on another bunk. Mary is trying herself on TikTok, like kids her age. Parents are okay with their daughter's new hobby, but they're worried about her studies. How to deal? 10,000 likes and she can forget about her homework. Sounds interesting. Let's go. Guys, like this video to help Mary finish filming. And the boring lessons aren't going anywhere. The Tom doll made a wardrobe for his lovely wife's stuff, and Kylie found a screw and is trying to figure out where it came from. Clearly not from the wardrobe, maybe from Tom's head. He did a bad job making the wardrobe, and now it's falling on Kylie. Her husband couldn't let that happen. He's a real hero. It's all because of guilt. Kylie is absolutely fine, and it seems like we can congratulate Tom. They're laughing together and not fighting. It's a success. In the magical doll universe, Tom doesn't have to bother much. If you want a TV, just shake it out of the phone. Oh, he almost forgot about the remote. If Kylie leaves him, then he'll simply pull the new girl out of the trunder. This life is perfect. He doesn't even have to go to the store to buy snacks. To be honest, I want to be a Mary doll, at least for a day. Tom was planning on doing nothing all day long, but Kylie doesn't think so. She smelled something bad, and obviously, it's Tom. She just got a special app for washing a guy. She'll have to rub it well. Hope there'll be enough soap for him. What a cool app. The girl's life becomes more romantic with it. Tom is just perfect now. Maybe unhappy, but perfect. 
But who cares if Kylie's happy? The Tom doll decided to go through his doll wardrobe. He'll need to ask his wife's advice. It's like she feels he decided to wear a wrinkled t-shirt. Of course, it fits his wrinkled face. This is what a guy's shirt should look like, but they'll need to do something with the wall. They'll do it later. Mary bought a new toy with the money saved from her lunches, but the games still look a bit aggressive. It hurt her dad to watch. Why can a doll that looks like him stand up for himself? The situation went too far. Mom decided there would be enough space for all the dolls in the house. And that's how a new chapter appeared in the universe of dolls. The guys started competing for Kylie's attention right away. Mary thought there was too much free space in the house. So she brought the stuff she had nowhere to put. Even dad liked the idea of using the attic as a shelf, but a huge poof can break it. There must be a line in everything. Will they fight again? Mary solved this problem very simply. She can simply make everything smaller and then put it in the house. Sounds like a great idea. It's good that dad has strong hands and knows how to do it. Guys, ask your dad to do this. Maybe it'll work out. It's amazing, but he can't make them big anymore. The main thing is that Mary's family life is getting better. The girl decided to set up her doll's house a little. She found the right furniture in a magazine. Cool. But a 2D sofa isn't very practical. This is where mommy's help comes in handy. Dad used to have a flat sense of humor. She fixed it. Now he has no sense of humor at all. The mom's magic needed a moment to solve the sofa issue. You just need to really want something and it will definitely work out. Mary thought it was time for the dolls to do yoga. The dolls must be flexible. Kylie's doing great. And Tom is scared to even imagine what Mary will do to him now. Well, you can see the emotion on his face. The guy's never done a stretch in his life. It turns out not everything new feels nice. Mom decided to help her daughter a little, but she did too much and broke her nail. It's a disaster. The whole family came because of her screams. Mom floods the house with the tears like it's raining really hard. The roof is not designed for such weather conditions, but now it can withstand even the hail or meteorite. And dad can fix a nail too. He's a jack of all trades. Hope mom will still have her hands after this. Wow, he's really talented. They are slowly turning into a happy family. Mary did a good job with the house facade while mom was working on hers. Dad was reading a book and suddenly he had another brilliant idea. He can use this situation. He used to irritate mom, but now he can also irritate her nose from the inside. She sneezed all her makeup. She'll need to redo it. But where did it go? Ah, uh, okay. That's awkward. Mary worked like a bee and got hungry like a crocodile. She's ready to eat a hippo. Mom wanted to order fast food, and Dad supported her for the first time. They are on the right track. Like this super fast food delivery guy. Why is he in a good mood? He works as a delivery guy. He hurried so much that he turned the food upside down and shook it all. He still has the audacity to wait for a tip. Ugh, mom lost her temper. The guy is used to it, but this time it went well. Mom learns to cope with her anger. Boom! Everything from the package flew right into the hands of the beautiful family. What a twist! So now they're setting up the backyard. It must have a soft lawn. Wow. And of course, the patio furniture. Oh, but Dad got too excited about making everything smaller. He accidentally did it to Mary. He's having a panic attack. Dad needs to get everything back before Mom notices. Phew! Everything is in place. And here's Mom. She's carrying a huge pool. It's gonna take some time to deal with it. He's probably just tired and nervous. They should try and do it together. They did it! The strength of the family is in its unity. Tom and Kylie are becoming closer and closer. They're so excited their hearts are trembling. 
some finishing touches, and the dollhouse backyard is ready. Great job. Building together is more fun than fighting and blaming each other. Mom and Dad didn't have a single fight for two days. This is an incredible success. Mary managed to patch up all the cracks in her parents' marriage and remind them that they're together because they love each other. Oh, Daddy has to go to work. She's been saving her lunch money for this. Mm. But, ugh, inflation. Oh. A whole zero got added to the price. Should she give up on her dream and die? No way. Dad is going to create an amusement park right at home. Dad would do anything to make his daughter smile. Even make a swing. Doesn't that look fun? Maisie's enjoying herself thoroughly. Mom is here to see how things are going. She's impressed. She just doesn't know that Dad used her laundry line and that all the clothes are on the floor now. He'll be in big trouble for this one. He's so stressed that he's feverish. Maybe he can dry the clothes now. Maisie is asking her dad for her allowance. But that's not how this amusement park works. She'll have to guess where the cash is hidden. Will she luck out and find the treasure? Hey, guys, comment below and tell her which balloon the cash is in before she pops them all. Mom and Dad are very different, and they're fighting again. Opposites attract, no, no, apparently. No. The wall will no. never get changed at this rate. Mm. Someone has to get involved. Maybe Maisie? Oh. She loves cutting out horses. Her parents should be more like her. Mm. Less fighting, Whoa. more action. <laughs> Let's decorate the wall together. Mm. It'll be wow. fun. Come on. The wall shouldn't be how mom and dad want it, but how Maisie mm. wants it. <laughs> A ferris wheel surrounded by soft clouds. Maisie made a garland out of carousel horses. Perfect! Being a mom is hard work, and it's unpaid. Washing dishes is boring. That is a cool idea. We have a new attraction, a water shooting game. Washing dishes is so much fun now, you can't even stop. Whoever has the best aim gets dessert. Mom is a real sniper. Maybe there's something we don't know about her past. The plates are squeaky clean. But now someone needs to clean the floor. The winner! Dad made a maze for his daughter. Getting out will be tough. Keep going, Maisie. Never stop reaching for your dreams. This maze is endless. Dad is catching up on his reading while Maisie gets lost. She's totally trapped. Where should she go? Dad's asleep. Mom is looking everywhere for Maisie. Where is she? The manager needs to put an end to this. How long has Maisie been trapped in here? It feels like forever. Hmm. Dad doesn't know how hmm. this game works, but Maisie has some ideas. Dad, don't look or you'll ruin the surprise. He's like a nail that needs to be hammered in. Maisie is loving this. Dad hasn't even told her that the game can't be fixed. Hit the toy, not your dad. That's boring. Dad's head hurts now, and Mom wants him to clean. But Dad is done for the day. Dad has watched a lot of YouTube videos, and now he thinks he's a magician. He has an amazing show planned for us. He'll make his daughter disappear. Maisie turned into a flower. Mom is terrified. What is that? A cooler? Seriously? Mom is feeling pretty bad, and Dad has to help her. One more try. This should work. Wait, that's not Maisie. 
Is it? <laughs> Magic is a dangerous thing. How can we get Maisie instead of this boy? The trick went out of control. So did the boy. Sugar high. It's nice that he likes it here, but his parents must be looking for him by now. <laughs> it's time to pay up. Wow, he's rich. Nice deal. Hmm. Hey. Maisie forgot to warn her parents that she works as a guard now. They grow oh. up so fast. Oh. We might get rich. Wow. Oh, hello, old friend. If you want to bully kids, you're not allowed in our amusement park. Dad seems busy. Oh, but he doesn't have the time to take out the trash? Mom is getting mad. He's busy working on a model car for Maisie. Dad is all caught up in his charts. But now Mom knows how to multitask. Why throw the trash away when Maisie can ride around on it? You know, like if she turns it into a car. <laughs> she loves this car. Who cares if it has legs instead of wheels? <laughs> Excuse me, what's the speed limit? Here's her first ticket. Take a picture, it'll last longer. We'll have to confiscate the car for investigation. Dad has a new idea, a trampoline, hmm. so Maisie can jump all the way to the sky. Make a frame out of old metal tubes. The frame is ready. What will we use for the trampoline itself? Oh, he has an old leather jacket. Hey. Mom wow. likes Dad's invention. He made a big sacrifice for his daughter. The universe gave him a big reward. He loves Maisie so much. Here's a new feature. A haunted house? So scary! Is it Huggy Wuggy? Nope, it's the dentist. How much does this cost? Yikes! Every amusement park needs popcorn. Even an amusement park at home. Mom is getting hungry and she wants to watch TV. Okay. But she'll have to pay. Hmm. Nothing personal, this is just okay. business. For two bucks, oh. this is all you can have. Oh. If you want more, pay up. Yeah. No refunds. Oh. Dad made a doll for Maisie. <laughs> you can change your clothes based on her mood. Dad didn't say he started by making a horse and that he failed miserably. But who cares? Maisie's happy. She has a surprise for Dad, too. He'll love it. A paper shirt and tie. It looks good, but he shouldn't wear it in the rain. Another game. Let's see how good Mom's aim is. Okay. Hmm. Wow, it's actually great. Cool. Maisie's wow. super proud of her mom. She can't even stop. Everything looks like a target to her. This is getting ridiculous. Is dad her next target? Wow, the ring is on his finger. Mom can do anything. That's not even the first time she's done that to him. Huh. Dad can't uh, stop. Hmm. He hasn't felt hmm. this alive yeah. ever since he got fired. The amusement park has another fun thing. One of these balloons is Whoa. full of water. It's all down to luck now. And dad is the unlucky one. Mom is doing better. Or not. This can't go on. Hey, dad, where are you going? He's going to shower while he plays. Come on. Mom's not lucky anymore either. News of the amusement park makes it around town fast. Oh, Springfield. Guests mean money. He could use the money right now. The guests love all the games and rides. They're having so much fun. And it's getting a little rowdy. Maybe he should have hired a real guard. Just one kid is bad enough, let alone a whole crowd. Hopefully the walls survive. Dad worked so hard to put all this together. And now he's watching it get destroyed. At least the slide survived. 
Or not. Mm. The parents worked <sighs> so hard for Maisie. And their effort huh? paid off. <gasps> now Dad doesn't have to look for a new job. They're rich. Huh? They can afford anything they want now. Yeah. Like going to a real amusement park. Oh. Hey, guard, let us in. Mm. Maisie's actually banned. Or maybe that's not even her on the photo. Take a closer <laughs> look, loser. Bye-bye. Maisie and her dad are going to go on all the rides. Come on. Jackson and Kylie are having a baby soon. They're so happy. And they just bought a house. They can't wait to set up the nursery. But it's so full of junk. Yikes. Good thing there's a professional on the job. Her crew is the best of the best. Jackson and Kylie will never forget this remodel. There's more work than Kylie expected. She'd rather lie down while the guys do the work. Jackson's back hurts. It's his old sports injury. The poor construction worker's going to have to do it alone. This is his job, and he'll do it no matter what. Two hours later, all the old junk is out of the room. Good thing it didn't have to go far. Now we can use the kitchen as storage. Jackson doesn't like this idea. But it's too late to change things now. The contractor's back hurts too. It's all up to Jackson now. Choosing a crib is serious business. And it's expensive. Jackson likes saving money. He can get a crib without going broke. Baby has a crib and dad has money. Kylie should be proud of her amazing husband. She's about to take a nap, but she has no idea what's waiting for her. Well, this used to be Kylie's bed. Parenting is all about sacrifice, right? Six hours of fighting later, they finally settled on a wall color. Dylan is happy that they finally reached a decision. But then they changed their minds. Kylie found the perfect color, and it's Final. Well, almost. Jackson just remembered that he loves blue. Let's just leave the wall like this. We can decorate the spot somehow. It'll be easier than repainting everything. Balloons will cover the paint. <laughs> Kylie's feet are swollen. Good thing her caring husband is here. Dylan believes that home improvement is more important than Kylie's hey, feet. No. But Jackson has his priorities in order. Dylan assumed Jackson just likes giving foot massages, so he offered him his own. That's shockingly rude. Don't make Jackson mad. He used to be a pro wrestler. His iconic move is the human knot. Dylan is from Texas. Being a cowboy is in his blood. This cloud is shaped like a cow, and Dylan's gonna lasso it. Told ya. Jackson is paying attention. He spent a lot of summers on his Uncle Joe's ranch. He can do it, right? Yeehaw! Keep going! Oops, he went overboard. He doesn't need a window washer. The poor guy starts washing everything he sees. Now Dylan's forehead's all shiny. Delivery for you. Jackson doesn't remember ordering anything, but someone has to pay. What's inside? Maybe Dylan knows. All this tool must be for a canopy. Kylie will be so happy when she sees what they did. Well, they were her packages, and she wanted to handle them. The canopy is great and all, but the boys ruined everything. They mixed up the boxes. Why didn't you just read what it said? Now Kylie has a canopy instead of a wedding dress and a weird flip-flop instead of a canopy. That was a hard day. When Kylie gets some rest, Jackson is going to have some sneaky candy. He promised he'd cut down on processed sugar, but he's craving it. Kylie's morning was off to a good start, but that didn't last. At first, she thought Jackson was pregnant instead of her. That would be awesome. But then she figured it out. Dylan can't find his measuring stick to get the right height. 
What? Jackson suggests oh. using the baby's height meter instead. Oh. That's a stupid hey. idea. But not stupider than using the height meter to tie back your hair. Oh. Can you please be more mature? Dylan is trying to convince Jackson to get a dream catcher. But he can't afford it. He can just make one using what he learned on Trim Trim Trick. Is he implying that our videos are boring? Dylan, too? You're the boring ones. You can't even make a basic dream catcher. Kylie's here to rescue them. Look, Kylie did a great job. The guys slept through everything. Oh, it was all because of the dream catcher. It puts babies to sleep. And adult babies, too. Finally, the pillows Kylie ordered for her baby got delivered. And of course, the guys start a pillow fight. Jackson isn't used to losing. And Dylan loses all the time. The pillows aren't toys or boxing gloves. Jackson is going to beat the snot out of them. But all that's coming out is feathers. Kylie is furious. Jackson's never seen her this mad before. He's so eager to do what she says. Dylan isn't that excited. It turned out even better than before. But they started fighting again. These two are unbelievable. Kylie has been eating for two lately. Or three. Or a hundred. And Jackson supports her. He's the most supportive husband ever. Your jeans won't button. Wear PJs instead. Kylie realized how to make the best yeah. of this situation. Now everything the baby needs is right here. This is a bag for the baby's snacks. We'll need a daisy, too. Jackson is so lucky. So is Kylie. Jackson's a real treasure. Jackson plays too many games on his phone, and he ignores his lovely bride. Kylie can't remember the last time he complimented her. Jackson knows how to compromise. Kylie's belly is so round now that he could hide a whole statue behind it. Video games have always been Jackson's passion, and working makes him sad. First his mom didn't let him play, now his wife. This is so sad. The baby needs a toy box. Jackson and Dylan can handle it. They cover a box in fabric. This used to be Kylie's coat. Shh, don't tell. She's happy that her husband is working so hard for their baby's future. The box turned out great. All the toys fit. Good job. Now they can play. They earned a few rounds of their game. This battle will go down in history. Dylan can't find the blueprints of the pillows that Kylie wants anywhere. The file is corrupted. Jackson doesn't understand. He'll try to get out of it using candy. Dylan took him too literally and started working on a solution. A few more finishing touches and the surprise will be ready. A candy pillow will make sure you have the sweetest dreams. Well, Jackson was shocked, and they decided to not even show Kylie. She's pregnant, and too much stress is bad for the baby. Yeah, Dylan, you messed up this time. Dylan doesn't have enough rope to tie these pieces together. So he's going to borrow some of Jackson's laces. That's perfect. It's nice and tight. Jackson wasn't expecting to be tripped. Kylie will help him by offering him some maternity shoes. They're comfy and they don't have laces. Jackson is such a sleepyhead. He'll sleep through the baby's birth at this rate. The kitchen sink is broken and needs fixing. Come on, Dad. Fix it. Jackson is great at repairs. The sound of the drill is like a lullaby to him. Dylan was walking past, and he thought Jackson got stuck. He can't let his friends struggle like that. He uses his brain and body to help Jackson out. But that's not good enough. Jackson didn't want this. The nursery is done. Kylie is so happy. Dylan can't wait to get paid and go on vacation. He wants to go to Vegas. 
But Dylan's boss thinks too much money is bad for him. Hmm. And he shouldn't go on vacation right now. We can't live like this. Jackson and Kylie have to go. They have an ultrasound appointment. This is so exciting. They're about to find out if it's a boy or a girl. The doctor is being suspiciously quiet. And Jackson's in a cold sweat. Good news, it's a girl. But wait, there's more. It's a boy. You're having twins. Double the babies, double the stress. And fun. So we need to build another nursery? Do you want to see them do it? Tell us in the comments. Thanks for checking out this video. Be sure to like and subscribe. See you next time.